Yo, what's going on guys? Today, we'll be running what'll be one of the best decks after the balance changes. Oh man was hoping he'd play a cannon or bomb tower. We're up against one of the most accurate players of all time, Riley. Gonna delivery. This could be a really good matchup if he has cannon, but if he has the bomb tower, it could be pretty difficult. I think I saw him running bomb tower earlier, so... Not looking forward to this. We're definitely gonna have to go opposite lane. Gonna log this barrel. The only nice thing is that Royal Hog's Earthquake does still force out something more than just a bomb tower, which is nice. It's still usually a negative trade though. Just gonna go in here, try to get some early damage. He's gonna start rocket cycling us later. Okay, well, this will be pretty bad. Can't really ever do anything if he's smart about his bomb towers like this. Just have to be a bit careful of his princess, mainly. Nice to force out the goblins. Gonna delivery queen for his princess. He's gonna mighty minor on this, but I think he may have to play something else because of the recruit. We can pop this ability. Recruit should tank for this. Okay, I'll take it. On our next hog, he's push. He's gonna have to waste a log or something or goblins because he has no ice spirit in cycle to combo with the bomb tower. So I'll take it. We can just go in, just want to keep on trying to get ship damage. Yeah, I don't know what, what we're going to do here. Once he starts rocket cycling us, we can try to set up a queen in the opposite lane and then... Uh, cycle a bunch of hoggies really quickly, try to outcycle him. And it's only the princess, that's the only thing. Pretty much even at this point. Gonna go in here, pretty earthquake for the bomb tower. Uh, yeah, no damage. Can't really do too much here. It's better to save the log for the princess and delivery for the barrel. I'll just go for the log though, because I don't want to test my reaction timing. Gonna pre-earthquake. Probably not gonna be any damage though. We are up a little bit, and he's gonna start rocketing us any second. Yeah. We can just queen here, apply some pressure with the hoggies here, try to use the three card cycle. I think that's our only way to win. Gonna pop the queen ability. Force out something. Not too good, not too bad. Gonna cannon here, I just wanna log his next princess. Gonna scale these up high, pull this towards the cannon, we can set up the queen. If he tries to rocket cycle us, our queen might go kind of crazy here. We can log the princess. Okay. This is our time, boys. And girls. Royal hogs. Pre-earthquake for the bomb tower. We can fire spirit skellies. Really bad barrel placement. <laughs> okay, I think he has nothing. He's gonna goblins. We can log this. <laughs> oh, let's go. Queen is on tower. Let's go. Easiest win of my life. Good game. I have to bring back something for this match. It's time. It's hogging time. We're up against Rummy Eli. This will be a pretty difficult matchup. Nice hog hit. It's always good to do that ice spirit trick. Often makes your opponent mess up their tornado. I'll go for the high mortar. He has to play something. Nice goblins catch. Gonna log these spear goblins. Okay, good night by him. I definitely want to go same lane in this matchup if possible. We'll see what happens though. He has no big spell, that's the only good thing for us. Gonna kite this with the hog rider. We just have to be so careful of the magic archer. I mean Eli is crazy with the magic archer. In a bad way. <laughs> At least for me. He always magic archers, goblins, skeletons, anything he can line it up on. Gonna mortar up high. He's probably gonna bomb tower, but it's okay. Nice goblins catch again. Yeah, there's the bomb tower. I'll take the earthquake on everything, making sure to always hit the king tower. His king tower is already pretty low. Not a half bad start. He always gets really good magic archers against me later on though, on just the most random stuff. I'll go for the hog rider ice spirit trick. 
Try to get some more damage. Always nice to force out the knight on just the one elixir ice spirit. Gonna musket here. His king tower is actually getting pretty low. Gonna log these wall breakers. <laughs> we can't stop that. I'll just go for the mortar, try to get some damage back. Just like that. We lost our damage lead. Gonna earthquake this. He's gonna have to play something. Okay. Just gonna go for... Oh no. Log. Okay, that was close. Gonna musket here down low. Uh, mighty monitor. And I, I don't like spear goblins either. Okay, beautiful prediction. Let's go. We're down so much though. He's gonna bomb tower. Just gonna earthquake. Try to get back to our hog rider quickly. Okay, one nice hog hit. Thought he would tornado. Just gonna mortar up high. Goblins catch. Perfect. We're catching all of his miners. Gonna hog rider ice spirit again. He's probably gonna tornado. Yeah. Uh, log this. Mortar up high. Goblins. We're actually winning because of the king tower. Well, not anymore. Gonna pre mighty monitor, make sure he can't magic archer. Just gonna pop this ability in hog rider. Pre earthquake for that bomb tower. He may have to tornado. Oh, beautiful hog hit. Gonna musketeer down low. Goblins up high. Not looking too good. We probably lost already. This will be really close though. Gonna mortar up high for out something. Mighty monitor for the monitor. And he's playing the monitor in the same spot every single time. Gonna wait a second and pop this ability. I just can't trust the magic archer. Gonna log this. Hog rider here. Free earthquake on a bomb tower. Nice. Just gonna wait a second. Log. Okay, I'll pop this ability. Oh no, it didn't go off. Uh, we can musketeer. Pretty bad magic archer. Hog rider. Log everything away. Oh no. I think we lost. Gonna mortar up high. Hog rider here. Ice spirit for the magic archer. Perfect. Log it back. Wait. Wait. He might get three crowned. Oh no. Okay. Nice catch. We can hog rider again. We have to be so careful of the magic archer. He's gonna magic archer. Okay. Mighty monitor up high. Pop this ability. Mortar. Oh no. Oh, I think we lost. Wait. Wait, we need another earthquake. If we get another earthquake, I think we just won. I think he just deactivated his king tower. Let's go. Good game. We're back to Royal Hogs. I have to keep switching between Hog Earthquake and Royal Hogs because a lot of people are sniping right now, trying to play specific decks just to counter certain players. Gonna delivery. Pretty sure this guy's running Sparky. We have to be pretty careful in single elixir. Okay, I'll just go in. It's worth it when they spend either a Sparky or a Goblin Giant in the back. Should be some good damage here. Hunter won't really do too much for him anyways. He doesn't even have too much elixir now to support this. Just gonna cannon. I'll queen up high just in case he wants to lightning. Don't really trust this guy. And the spear goblin's range is so long on the goblin giant. Gonna pop this early ability. Perfect. Nice one hit. Always good to get damage on both sides with royal hogs. Alright, gonna fire spirit. This should splash the sparky unless he plays something. We do have a pretty bad cycle right now though. Need to get back to our cannon really quickly or we could be in a little bit of trouble. Okay, this will be a really good delivery. Gonna cannon. We are cycling pretty quickly. Uh, I don't want a queen. Just gonna fire spirit. Log this back. Skeletons. Delivery. Okay, I thought that sparky would do something. Oh no. 
the recruit. What just happened? We have to earthquake. Feels so bad. We're down so much elixir now. I know he has lightning too, so it's going to be pretty difficult once we hit double and triple elixir. He's going to start lightning cycling us pretty much. Just going to fire spray it. Free plus one trade. He's going to go in for the sparky in a second. I'll just go for the hoggies. Perfect timing. Might start pushing on the right side. Don't want to go same lane. We have to try to cycle to our cannon again pretty quickly. He might lightning. Just gonna delivery here. Pop the queen ability. Push this hunter back to reset it. Okay. We can scale these up high. Pretty good defense. Gonna go in here. I'll earthquake. He's just lightning cycling us. So it's fun for us to be a bit aggressive too. Gonna log all of this back. Fire spirit up high. I'll let the dark prince go. Gonna cannon. You always want to play your cannon a bit in the opposite lane so they can't lightning everything. He may try to lightning this queen, we'll see. Okay. Gonna delivery. Uh. Cannon. Another delivery. Oh man, I think we lost. We have such a bad cycle now. <laughs> oh man. Just have to queen. We have to set up for defense. Don't think there's too much of a point to go in with the hoggies anymore. Gonna earthquake this queen ability. He's gonna lightning for sure in a second. Yeah, gonna cannon late. No, we lost. It's just the lightning. Okay, I'll just go in. He can sparky if he wants to. Okay, should still be some pretty good damage though. Okay, not really. That was not what I was hoping for. Just gonna earthquake this. I don't want to play the queen too low this time. Just gonna go for it all the way up. Try to defend without our cannon even if possible. Gonna pop this ability. Delivery this. Pull this. Log everything back. We're already back to delivery. <laughs> We're defending well. Gonna cannon. He might try to lightning. Okay, gonna delivery. He may go for a late lightning. We have to be a bit careful. Okay, I'll just go in. He can't be that high on elixir now. A little bit of damage. Gonna early cannon. Skelly's up high. We just have to go in. I don't think he can defend. We can't defend either though. Earthquake. Please. Let's go. Good game. We're up against this guy. I'll go for the hog first play. Gonna have the earthquake ready. Okay, I'll take it. Free tower damage. He might have the OG log bait deck. This should be a really good matchup. It's always nice to face Inferno Tower because it's always a negative one trade for your opponent when they play it against your hog rider. So it's a bit easier to outcycle them. Gonna mortar here. He should have like Pretty much no way to stop it, I think. Gonna musketeer up high, snipe down this knight. Wait, he's not running log bait. He might just have a minor cycle deck, by the looks of it. Could even be hog rider. I'll just go in here. Mighty minor for the queen. Try to outcycle him. Beautiful hog hit. Definitely don't want to go same lane though. There's no way for us to kill his archer queen. That's the problem. Gonna goblins up high. I'm not even sure if I'll run this deck or hog giant skeleton next season. I don't think hog giant skeleton will be good because the mighty modern nerf is just way too small now. Gonna hog here. Mighty minor for the modern. He's probably going to Inferno Tower. It's fine. I'll just take the, the free Earthquake damage. I think next season I'll just run Royal Hogs Earthquake. I'll pop this ability. Might force out something a little bit more.
Alright. We can't really mortar right now, just have to wait for him to waste his queen on something, then we can go in. Okay. Just have to wait for this knight to die. I'll go in for the mortar. See what counters he has to it. <laughs> oh, it's nice to see the defensive monitor. Guys, if I'm slightly dead right now, it's because it's really late. Gonna mortar. And the season ends at 2 a.m. of my time. Okay, I'll hog router. He has no inferno tower, so why not? Gonna log these goblins. No damage. Gonna musketeer all the way up high. Don't want to give him any free poison. He might queen here. We have to be careful. Okay. I'll just pre-earthquake. Not too good, not too bad. Gonna musketeer down low. He could poison if he wants to. Kind of just have to give it to him. Okay. Queen should be dead. I'll go in for the mortar. He has no queen in cycle, so gonna cause him a little bit of trouble. Gonna pre-earthquake for the... Thing. <laughs> Bit of damage on the right side. Not too much, though. I'll suck with a mighty monitor. Okay, we can go in for the mortar again. I don't really want to get damage with it. Just want to force him to cycle stuff that he doesn't want to cycle. We can musketeer up high. Mortar should splash the queen a little bit, hopefully. Nice goblins catch, nice bendy monitor ability. Dead queen. We can go in. We have the three card cycle going too. Nice mortar shot. Hold up. Aw. Oh. Gonna hog here. He has to respond to the goblins too. We can mortar. Look at the goblins damage. Man. Gonna Earthquake this. Mighty Miner in front. Nice catch. He's gonna really start spamming us right now. Gonna Hog Rider. Pre-log for goblins. Earthquake. Beautiful log. <laughs> he just missed the Inferno Tower? Hello? I'm just confused. <laughs> I'm as confused as you guys probably are. Never seen that happen. Just gonna mortar. I don't think he has enough time. Nice musketeer. Gonna earthquake to kill this. <laughs> Alright, let's go. Super nice wins. We're so close to number one. This is me after. I was in a match against Pedro for a top 3 finish, maybe even number 1. Went in for the Hoggies. Wanted to get my Earthquake down on the Mortar. But then, Riley calls in an airstrike on my Wi-Fi. <laughs> and yeah. There goes the top 3 finish, if not number 1. I tried to come back, but the Valkyrie just kind of destroyed me. Was still a fun season nonetheless. Thank you to all of you who are watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye!